let's see now comparison between order and molecularity there is difference between order and molecularity before watching this video please ensure that you have seen previous videos see this column is order and this column is molecularity first one it can be zero and even a fraction order can be zero and even a fraction you have seen zero order reaction and fractional order reaction so it can be zero or even a fraction but molecularity cannot be zero or a fraction see molecularity zero means there is no reacting species there is no reacting species then how can you get product they, they, they cannot be zero molecularity and there can then there is there will be no reaction so molecularity cannot be zero even molecularity cannot be a fraction let's see now see here uh, two molecules of carbon monoxide will combine with one molecule of oxygen to give you two molecules of carbon dioxide in this in reality always integer number of molecule will come in two three four or one like this see two molecules of carbon monoxide and one molecule of carbon uh, one molecule of oxygen will combine to give you the product but in some time what we write this reaction only uh, just to balance our simplicity uh, co plus half o2 gives uh, co2 but in reality one molecule of uh, carbon monoxide and half molecule of oxygen cannot combine to give you one molecule of uh, carbon dioxide always molecules will combine in integer number only two molecule of co and one molecule of oxygen combine to give you two molecules of carbon dioxide it this reaction is not possible in reality just to balance the reaction sometime we use fraction in the uh, in the fractions in the reaction so molecularity cannot be a fraction see one one more difference order is applicable to elementary as well as complex reaction you know that uh, all the people uh, you have seen zero order first order third order all the examples for those order reaction or elementary reaction you have seen order applicable for them and you have also seen in uh, maybe in part, uh, part number uh, 32 or 33 video we have seen order is applicable to complex reaction also you have seen how order is applicable to complex reaction complex slowest step of the complex reaction is rate determining step and uh, for that slowest step you will apply rate law from that rate law you can determine order and uh, you also know that molecularity of uh, slowest step of the complex reaction is the order of the reaction so order is applicable to elementary as well as complex reaction see molecularity is not applicable to complex reaction we have seen this in previous video that molecularity is not applicable to complex reaction but it is applicable to each step of the complex reaction it is not applicable to whole complex reaction and it is only applicable to elementary reaction the reaction which takes place in single step for that only molecularity is applicable okay Thank you.